Hey guys, I'm the founder of ATK Designs and Extreme Gaming, and I've been getting a lot of messages lately saying that I should make some tutorials. The thing is, I'm fine with that, but I don't know what you guys want to learn. However, I did get some emails asking me to uh, make a tutorial on this, so here it is. Uh, what I'm teaching right now is actually how to import a picture from your Photoshop file uh, to, I mean, from your Photoshop to Cinema 4D. Basically, you can, and doing that, you can make stuff 3D and, you know, use it. So right now, we have a picture here, and you probably want your picture to be transparent. Otherwise, it's just going to look like a square. Once you have that, right now, I have this cool logo I found online. Um, and as, it, as you can see, it's already transparent. Uh, because I use the magic wand tool so once you have this you wanna um, what's it called sorry click on the square thing the little square and go select pixels and then it should underline the whole thing and then you're gonna wanna go to paths and I'm not sure if you guys can see that but the little arrow on the side once you click that say make work path and two pixels is fine and then once you have that uh, go to your file and export and then paths to illustri illustrator sorry <laughs> and once you have that just click OK save it as you know whatever you want uh, what I'm gonna do is 3d logo okay so save and then once this is saved um, open up your cinema 4d and basically wherever you save the file what you can do is just drag that file in your cinema 4d and click OK okay so once you have this um, you know, you're probably wondering what the hell should I do with it now? Well, because, you know, it's not 3D. How you can make this 3D is if you put an extrude nerve there and drag that into that, you're going to have a 3D file. So before you hate me, um, to watch the whole thing. Okay, so the, this is it. That's your cool little sick logo. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, I hope it was useful, if not, sorry. Uh, yeah, and also, if this helped you, please send me a message asking me what you want to see or what you want me to uh, teach to you guys anything. Um, so, yeah, thanks for watching. Till next time, see you later, guys.